Hey guys, it's Tiffany here. So today I am 34 weeks, no, not 34 weeks, 35 weeks, 35 weeks pregnant today. Um, and I have some things to show you guys before I get into my symptoms and all that stuff. Um, I got two gifts from the P.O. box that I told you guys about in my last video that were um, in my car and I didn't get to open them. And I am like so excited. Like I literally just opened them right now and I'm just like in shock. Like these gifts, they're just so cute. Okay, this is the first thing and this is from um, one of my subscribers named Lisa um, and this is what she sent it's a Mickey Mouse bathrobe look and it even has his name on it it says chance like this is the cutest thing ever like I've never seen this before this is so cute I love it <laughs> like how adorable is this so thank you so so much Lisa like this is the cutest thing ever like seriously thank you so much um, and the next gift that I got these are also personalized they are really really sweet um, and this is from what's her name uh, I just had it oh Christina and she sent these little crosses one says J one for Jaden and one for Chance how cute. And they say, Jesus, watch me through the night and keep me safe within your sight. Bless me in your loving way and wake me with the light of day. Thank you so much, Christina. These are like the most adorable thing ever. And I, I want to keep them together, but I guess I'll probably just have to put one in um, Jane's room or one in Chance's room. I'm not sure. But I just, I love these. Like this is very touching. Thank you so much. I really, really do appreciate it. Um, okay, so now for my 35 week update. Um, symptoms and experiences and all that good stuff. Um, I had a doctor's appointment last week sometime. I don't even remember what day it was on. But um, she measured my belly and she said that Chance is measuring two weeks ahead. No wonder he's been hurting me because he's a big boy. <laughs> and plus I'm smaller than I was with Jaden. Um, so yeah, he's measuring two weeks ahead. Uh, so he was, what well, I was 34 weeks when I went to the appointment and he was measuring at 36 weeks so she said she wouldn't be surprised if he's eight pounds and I'm like oh my goodness but it's funny because I told y'all a while back that I had a dream that he was like 10 pounds he was a 10 pound baby um so I'm not really surprised that he's big anyways and I heard that a lot of like your second children are um people's second children are bigger than the first so uh I would I'm not I'm not really surprised that he's measuring big uh, so now I have, I go back next week, so that was two weeks from my previous appointment, and then after next week's, week's appointment, I go back every week. So I go on, I go on May, May 2nd, and then May 10th, and then um, the week after that, and the week after that. And uh, my doctor said that um, because he's measuring bigger, I can choose to be induced at 39 weeks, which I can anyways, and, um, and... She said she would prefer that anyways. Well, if I if I want to, um, I can do it because if I go into labor naturally, I may not have that doctor, have my, my doctor, like I'll have whoever's on call. And um, I really, 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 really love my doctor. I told you guys before, like it's the same doctor that um, that uh, delivered Jaden. So I really, I really want her to deliver Chance too just because I'm so comfortable with her and I don't want any, I don't want any other doctor that I haven't seen, you know, my whole pregnancy. So we probably are going to set a an induction date um, for May 24th, probably, because she said um, I'll, we'll probably set it on my May 10th appointment when I'm, what, 37 weeks, I think? Yeah, 37 weeks, I think. Um, we'll probably set, set the, the date in stone, but I'm probably going to do it for May 24th, which is four days before my... Uh, my actual due date. So if he doesn't come on his own anyways before May 24th, then... Um, yeah, I'm probably going to set it for that day, which is exciting because that's basically in like four weeks, four, four or five weeks, something like that. Um, I know a lot of people are against induction, but I mean, it's my body. I know um, I basically was induced with, with Jaden, like I had Pitocin and everything. Um, so, you know, I, I, I know that it's worse in a sense um, getting induced because the contractions are coming faster and stronger and whatever else. But, you know, that's my choice. So just don't jump on me, whatever, for doing it. So we never know. He, he may come on his own before then. Um, but yeah. Um, the next time I go, I get um, 
I have to do the strep B test or whatever, I forget, and then I have to, they're going to check me for dilation, which is exciting. I hope that I'm dilated, and I feel like I will be dilated because I've been walking every day like crazy um, since it's been nice out. But now the weather's stupid, now it wants to be all cold. Uh, but yeah, uh, I have been walking a lot, and I also picked up some evening primrose oil, prim, prim rose oil. I think I'm saying that correctly. And uh, I've heard of women using this um, oil, orally and um, insertion, in, insert, insertion, is that how you say it? <laughs> um, so I'm going to try it. Um, it doesn't, you know, induce labor or anything. It just um, helps your service, cervix, you know, helps um, you to be effaced or whatever. So I'm probably going to um, start it like soon. Um, I think I think I saw some people using it like starting at 35 weeks. So I, I may, may do that. Um, if you have used it, let me know. I know some women said they used it and it didn't work, and some said that it did, so it wouldn't hurt to try. Um, uh, symptoms. I have been having, it's so funny, because right after I made that video, my last week video, and I said, oh, the heartburn's gone, that night it came back, and ever since that night, I've had it every single night, and it has been, like, the worst that it's ever been, this pregnancy. Like, it's been hurting really, really bad, like, really, really, really burning. It's like... I don't know, and, it's, and it only comes at nighttime, and it's weird, like, um, and I did drink milk, and, uh, it does, it does help it a little bit, and then I just go to sleep, and when I wake up, it's gone, but, yeah, the heartburn has just been insane lately, it, uh, it's just, uh, I just jinxed myself in the last video saying that I didn't have it, and it came right back, um, what else? I've been feeling pressure on my bladder, and I'm assuming that's because he's dropped and his head or whatever, and his movements. Like sometimes he'll do like movements, and it'll like like press on my bladder, and it hurts kind of bad. Um, and that's because he's a big old boy, <laughs> apparently. Um, and I've also been craving this this week. I've been craving Nutella. I've been eating eating Nutella on bread, and I've been putting Nutella on my strawberries, on strawberries, and eating them like crazy. I don't know. That's just. A random craving that I've been having and I, ha I hadn't really been craving anything uh, lately um, and another thing he has been getting the hiccups like every single day which is um normal obviously but uh, and I'm like what can I do can I drink some water for him to, for, for them to go away but obviously they just have to go away on his on on its own um, but yeah that's pretty much all I have uh, to tell you guys so I guess I'll show you guys my belly and then I will be back for my 36 week update vlog also um, after this video, I'm probably going to film my what's in my hospital bag because you probably can't see it. It was right here. I packed it already. <laughs> it's like, I'm just super excited. I'm just like ready to go. I just want to be, be prepared and, you know, ready. So, yeah, here's my belly and be looking out for that video. Here's my belly from the front with my shirt on. And the side with my shirt on. In the front with my top up. Still 37 inches around, which I was, that's what I was last week and the week before that. That's it, and I will see you guys in my 36-week update video. Love you guys.